Hi, my name is Damien and I need your help. I want to make a documentary about suicide, mental illness, and depression. Specifically, those things in relation to kids and uh, juveniles and young adults. Now, I've got a million reasons in my head why I want to do this. If you live in Red Deer, you probably don't need to ask, but uh, mostly it's the, the timidity and the shyness and the quiet that is associated with those things at that age range. People, that, people at that age, they need something, they need discussion, they need um, just information and, and stuff uh, about this stuff, but they can't get it from adults because we all shut up when, when this stuff happens. Um, the material we give kids about suicide, mental illness, and depression comes in the form of a guidance counselor um, or a therapist or a speaker hired to come into your school, usually, um, which is good, and I'm not faulting anyone here. Um, but one, they're all adults, usually, um, and anyone my age or older is just not going to get through on that same level to people that age. It's just, it's most of the time it's not going to happen. Just accept that. And two, everything they see, all the materials they see, documentaries, um, programs for school, accompanying DVDs sold by the guy that they hired to speak at the school, those were all made by a committee, um, a group of parents, a group of teachers, people who have vetted and vetoed everything that went into the video. And this will come as no surprise to anyone that has children, but kids are not stupid. Kids see that, and they look at that stuff, they think that's as hilarious as we think all those movies about um, marijuana from the 60s were. You remember Reefer Madness? That's how dumb the movies that we make about depression and suicide are for kids now. Because they're living it. They know what it's really like. So that's why something needs to be made like what I want to make, which is just straight up brutally honest, right from the horse's mouth, um, life. You know, kids talking about their life, kids talking about how they feel um, in such an honest way that you'll feel uncomfortable. Uh, and, and I think that's going to be far more beneficial than anything else because... Well, one, it'll break the hush, because whenever you're really quiet about something, there's this bubble that grows, uh, this vacuum of air um, that turns into a stigma, uh, and then pe people become afraid to talk about whatever's in the bubble, so people don't talk about mental illness and suicide, and especially parents in, in relation to children, you know, they get worried they're going to trigger something, they're going to say the wrong thing. What do, what do I know? Um, how do I know what, I, what I'm talking about? I'm not certified for this. And they look for authority, and there is no authority on these things. Um, there are people who have experience, but there's no authority. Mm -hmm. To break that bubble, you just need a slice of brutal honesty and, and, and speech. Someone needs to stand up and talk through that bubble, and that's what I want this documentary to be. Bits and pieces of kids talking about you know, wanting to commit suicide, the times they've tried to commit suicide, um, cutting themselves, being depressed. Um, I want to hear the stuff that everyone else is terrified of hearing because I know that when I was their age, when I was 15, that had I had access to something like this, I would have seen someone like me. I would have seen I'm not alone and I'm not weird and other people are thinking and feeling the same things and while I wasn't listening to adults then uh, I may have seen you know over the course of this documentary over the course of seeing 30 different people talk about very similar things the, little, the ball might have got rolling in my head I might have started seeing patterns I might have started seeing hey this person does this a lot and this person does this a lot and this seems to lead to this and it might have started me thinking about things in a new way, and that's something that I think is missing for kids today, and young adults today. I think, you know, I think that they have a voice, they should be heard, and they have no outlet because as soon as we mention this kind of stuff, um, everyone over 18 shuts up. They just get tight-lipped and they shut up because they're too scared to say anything. 
and then this makes it very scary for anyone else to say anything. It's like when you're in a, a big, quiet room, like a library, it makes it very hard to burst out into song or say something really loudly or yell across the room. Um, and so we need something to break that silence, and that's what I want to make with this. I'm going to set up a website. Um, you might be watching this there already. It's probably going to be uh, DamienPepper.com, which is D-A-M-I-E-N, Pepper.com, slash documentary. And it'll have this video on it and probably a little bit more information and a contact form. Um, so if you have anything to offer that could help this documentary along, uh, if you have any kind of groups or associations, or even if you just know someone that might be interested in being in this video, send them to send them my way send them to the page um get them to drop me a line on the contact form um and i would very very much appreciate it